All right. It's really hard to pack in eight artists in a two-hour time frame. So if we can open it up all day, then it creates an opportunity to be able to feature more artists. You want to come early and bring the kids, you want to come later and crowd surf or party or uh, whatever you want to do, there's an opportunity for everybody. You can also just come and hang out all day, which could be hard on your liver, but still might be fun. The whole point of Hot Summer Nights is to invite everybody we know, everybody we work with or collaborate with, take a minute to just hang out with everybody and to kind of end the summer. People want to talk or connect or do a little networking, that, that can happen too, but more than anything, it's just a great time to hang out with, uh, with other like-minded, creative people that care about music and care about art and care about community and care about doing things for the right reasons. That's, that's the point, there's no other pretext or context, it's just come together, hang out, enjoy some music, and, and have fun. I don't know what time it was when we ended, but by 10 or 11, it seemed like uh, we were at capacity. I was a little nervous, hoping that a, a big wave of people didn't come in, because I don't know where we'd put them. And I uh, was really glad that the fire marshal didn't show up. <laughs> Some people might have noticed there was, there were some creepy clowns uh, wandering around. They keep people a little creeped out, but more than anything, it keeps you on your toes. I mean, who wants to get too drunk when you know that there's some creepy clowns nearby? Yeah.